On now to the awards for leading performances in a musical. Here to present best actress in a musical are two of our Olivier winners from last time. From Dear Evan Hansen, it's Sam Tutti. And from Anne Juliet, it's Miriam Teak Lee. <laughs> Thank you very much, everyone. It's a real pleasure to be here in front of all of you wonderful people. Thank you so much. Let's celebrate theater together. Oh my God, wow. This is very different to my living room as well. It's very bizarre, yeah, oh my gosh, yeah. <laughs> Honestly, standing on this stage in the Royal Albert Hall, surrounded by such incredibly talented, talented people, is just incredible. I mean, we must never forget how special the arts are and how incredible they are, and I'm so happy that we're a part of it. <laughs> <laughs> I'm terrified, I don't know what's happening, so yeah. <laughs> In 2020, these two won Olivier's. We had to do it in the bar at the Palladium. They never got the recognition for winning them. So let's give it up for them right now. I just want to thank my. <laughs> I was going to wear it around my neck, but we'll just get the end. <laughs> so I'm super excited to announce the best actress in a musical to these fantastic women. So the nominees are... Best actress in a musical. Jessie Buckley for Cabaret at the Kit Kat Club at the Playhouse Theatre. Sutton Foster for Anything Goes at Barbican Theatre. Beverly Knight for The Drifter's Girl at Garrett Theatre. Stephanie McKeon for Frozen at Theatre Royal Drury Lane. And the winner is... And can I just say, her performance gave me absolute shivers. <laughs> it's Jessie Buckley! <laughs> nightmare and my biggest dream all at once. I'm so sorry. Um, uh, okay, concentrate. Um, oh, um, on God, oh, I, I, okay, for, Re Re Rebecca Frecknell. <laughs> <laughs> That's a good place to start. <laughs> the space you created for all of us to not just escape to, but to live in and to share together. You're amazing. I'm so proud to be able to stand beside you and work beside you, and thank you for the opportunity. Eddie Redmayne, you Egypt for even asking me to do it. <laughs> thank you. <laughs> um, Tom, Julia, the entire creative team, the Kit Kat Club! and beautiful and talented and I am in awe of you all. I love you. <laughs> um, Lindy, I love you. I can't believe I stood on a mushroom little stool and had like hoop earrings and fake tan on and you said yes because I said I wanted to be like Judy Dench one day. <laughs> um, it's such... Oh, God, my family love you too. Um, it's... <laughs> It's, <laughs> it's such a huge, huge privilege to be part of this community, which I consider my family. Thank you for welcoming me, welcoming me in all those years ago. And this is just so lovely. Thank you. 